Hello guys, I'm here to tell you if you are ready for a rabbit. Now, are you really ready for a rabbit? Do you have enough money for a rabbit? Well, I'm here to talk to you about it. Now, this video is a great thing to watch if you are going to rap. So, all you have to do, just listen to me and answer my questions. <coughs> so, do you know what to give your rabbit? Do you know what to feed your rabbit? If you don't, why not you go on Google and see? Because that's real. That's really important. If you don't feed your rabbit the right food, it may die. And if you give it the wrong food, it might even be like really bad for it. So if you don't know that, go on Google or anything. So yeah. What do you feed your rabbit? Put it on a piece of paper and put it down. Write a list of what you need. So, we talked about what they need. Now, do you know how to comb your rabbit? Do you know what supplies you need for a rabbit? Well, it's really important for that too. Because if you don't have the right nail clipper, then it'll hurt its nails really bad. Now, guys, I'm not going to tell you anything you need. I'm just gonna, going to um, tell you, ask you, if you, have, if you do know what it is. So, we talked about that. Now, it's always good to look on a website because, yeah. Now, next thing. How do you know if your rabbit's healthy? If you don't really do those things I just told you to do a couple of times. Go on the internet. Like for the... All the stuff. Now, next thing. Are you even ready for a rabbit? Do you have the right? Can you do it by yourself? I don't think so. Because... People expect their kids to do it by the salt. And I got that from 101 Rabbit. Thanks, 101 Rabbit. So, um, also, if you want you to go on 101 Rabbit's website, it's real, it really helped me a lot. So, yeah. 101 Rabbit's website so awesome. It helped me a lot really it did. Anyway, carrying on. So, do you have the right? Are you only a little kid? And, are you gentle? And are you patient? If you're not gentle, I don't think it's that great. Because you can really hate your rabbit if you're not gentle. And also, you have to be patient. If it's still in its hutch and you want it to get out, you don't just budge it all around. You don't, like, touch it, keep poking it till it gets out. If you want to play with it and if it's still in its hutch, not getting out, be patient and wait till it either wakes up or until it just stands up and walks to you or something. Or you could just wait till it gets out of its hutch itself. So those are two important things. That's all. Thanks for watching. If this helped, can you please subscribe, like, dislike, anything. Comment. Just so I hope this helped. I hope this wasn't too long either. Thanks. Bye.